Hmm. Oh, dang. Oh, hey. Hey, do I remember you? Yeah, you were the uh, American team that we faced off back in Japan. Remember? My name is Kenma. It's nice to meet you again. Oh, we're just visiting. You know, for a tournament and whatnot. We had to fly over here to Japan. Or, not Japan. We had to fly over here to America to participate in the tournament. Because the American team didn't have enough money and funds to fly over to Japan. So, we had to take our own funds into hand and... Now we're here. It kind of sucks that we have to wear um, masks here. But I think our team can get used to it for a little bit. After all, we're only here for a week. Mm -hmm. So how have you been? After all, it's been about a year or so since we last met. Mm hmm. Ah, uh, okay. Well, again, it's great to meet you again. We had a very good conversation last time we met. And I hope this conversation goes well as well. Sorry if my English isn't the best right now. I have a little bit of jet lag from the trip over. Mm -hmm. Of course, playing video games is kind of a pastime for me. I enjoy it very much. Especially these handheld consoles. Oh, but I do have a gaming setup back at my home. Although it did cost me somewhat a lot of money, but I'm very happy with the outcome of what it is. Mm -hmm. Do you play video games? Nice. Maybe you should show me some of your games, if you don't mind that. Hmm. You don't mind? Cool. So, we are out in the city right now. I can't recall what city we're in, but... Where is your house? A few blocks down? Oh, okay. Do you want to walk there? Taxi. Mm. Well, normally in Japan, we usually just walk to our destinations. It's much more healthier. Or even a bike, at that matter. Okay, let's walk there. You seem a lot more or less agitated than your teammates. Why is that? Do you not take the sport volleyball seriously? Or do you just do it for fun like me? I see. You're just not really as competitive. Okay. I can understand that. I'm somewhat the same way. I just do it for my friends, to be honest. 
Mm-hmm. I've never seen these types of shops before. All these random shops in the corners. Why do you have so many shops? Tourists. You know, that makes a lot more sense now that I think about it. There are a lot of tourist spots in Japan as well, like McDonald's and whatnot. Mm hmm. <laughs> oh, I've known about America's、um, dangers at night. So I choose not to really go out at night around here. And plus, the hotel that we're staying at is pretty safe. It's a four and a half star rating. So it's a pretty decent hotel. And another thing, we got presidential. Oh, from our last winning funds, that covered most of the hotel and some leftover for food and whatnot. And obviously, transportation. Mm hmm. It's too bad we can only land at the nearest city because the next city over. Is where the tournament's happening. And it's about an hour, I think, three long drive. Mm hmm. Very long drive. Is your team on the tournament this time? Lost in the semifinals. That sucks. I'm sorry for that. Mm hmm. At least you got to the semifinals, though. You could take that as a small victory and just work more harder on your team and on your skills and whatnot. Yes. Mm hmm. Oh, we're getting close? Perfect. Say, when we get there, do you have any co op games and whatnot? Because I would love to play some video games with you. Oh, you do? What kind of、uh, co op game, if you don't mind me asking? Is it a first person shooter, platformer? Platformer. I'm pretty decent at those games. I can give it a shot with you as well. Oh, that's fine. I don't mind carrying my teammates sometimes. After all, I sometimes do it in the volleyball court. <laughs> yeah, my team can sometimes be a little hot headed to put into words. But I usually am the calm one in the group. So, I usually carry the team when things go south. Mm hmm. Oh, your house is coming up. All right. Is it that one with the sideways roof? Well, not sideways, but more angled. Okay. Well, I can't wait to play this co op game with you. I feel like you're gonna have a very fun time with me. And also, just to let you know, I'm not really competitive on the volleyball court, but when it comes to video games, I am somewhat competitive. After all, I did. Go into some video game tournaments before I started volleyball. Mm hmm. I usually get around third to first place all the time. 
Mm-hmm. That's how I could afford all my、uh, gaming setup and whatnot at, back at my home. Small tournaments, only going for like five grand for the first place and whatnot. Mm-hmm. <laughs> But enough talking. Let's go inside, so we can both play the game. <laughs> hey, kid. Yeah, I'm talking to you. Turn around. What do you think you're doing around my turf, huh? Come on, speak up! I don't got all day with you. Hmm. Just another random civilian, huh? <laughs> It doesn't matter if you're a civilian or not. You're still on my turf. You know what we do to civilians that don't know where their place is. <sighs> all right, all right, all right. Calm down, calm down. I'm not actually going to hurt you. Just give me some of your money, and we'll be on our way. Is this all you got? In all honesty, that's pathetic. With someone like your stature, or from the looks of it, I thought you would have a little bit more money than just a measly five hundred dollars. But I guess I was wrong. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> All right. Sit down. I'm not gonna hurt you. And plus, I already just robbed you for your money. So what's the point of even trying to hurt you anyway? Name is Misuya. Misuya Tanaki. Don't interrupt me. I'm trying to introduce myself. As I was saying, my name is Mitsuya Takashi. Nice to meet you. There's a lot of things you have to know about this area, so you don't have to run into people like me. There are a lot of gangs here, and I'm part of one of them. Second highest ranking, to be exact. So, you better watch your back, 'cause you don't know what who you're gonna run into. And lucky for you, you ran into me, and I'm a little bit more nice than the other people. If it wasn't me, you'd probably be dead on the ground, bleeding to death, beaten to a pulp. Mm -hmm. But besides that, where are you off to anyway? Other side of town. Why didn't you take the? You know what? Never mind. I'm just wondering why didn't you take the back streets instead of the main road? Couldn't you not see the amount of cars and motorcycles that are around here? That could have gave you the hint that something's going on.、Uh, well. Man, you're a lot more brain dead than I thought you were. 
I'm not supposed to be nice. I'm part of a gang, remember? Look. I'll help you out this time. Since, like I said, I already took your money. That's all I really need from you. Unless you have anything else of value. All right, then. P move your head that way. Look. See down the road? There's a fork. A fork in the road, yeah. If you go down the left path, that's the back streets. You'll be safe going down there. If you go the other way, you'll run into the other gangs that are around here. The back streets are through the woods and whatnot. I think the woods are safe for right now. I don't think anyone's out there. Unless you go through an open field with motorcycles, then you might be in trouble. Mm hmm. Don't thank me. Consider this another warning. Because I'm feeling grateful today. And I didn't want to shove your head into the concrete. <sighs> you seem like a pretty stand-up guy, actually. <sighs> Look. Take $200. I know the bus is kind of pricey today. Look, I already robbed you. That doesn't mean I'm being grateful. It means I'm trying to help your ass out. You get out of here as quick as possible so you can get to your damn location. Where are you even trying to go anyway? That's across town. Work. <laughs> Working, I see. You're a working person, huh? <sighs> well, I wish you good luck on your work and whatnot, and your travels. Let's just hope you don't run into me again. Otherwise, things might get a little bit messy for you. And by messy... I mean, you might be going to see a hospital in your future. Sound like a plan? All right, then. Now, if you excuse me, I have to get going myself. I have to go down the other pathway in the fork in the road. Eh, whatever. It's only like a few minutes down. Let's just walk together so I know you're safe. <sighs> Look. Like I said, consider this a warning. And don't thank me again. This shows you're soft. Mm-hmm. A lot of things, a lot of bad things happen around here to people who are unexpected. You have to make sure that you're safe at all times. I advise you to grab like a butterfly knife or something. Keep yourself protected. And if anything goes south, then you can actually do something. And not just cower like a little baby. All right. Okay. I have no idea where a shop like that could be holding butterfly knives and whatnot. I think there might be one in the town over, but I'm not really sure. And I'm pretty sure they're just antique. Mm hmm. 
Yeah. All right. We're coming up on the fork in the road. I'm going my way. You go yours. Good seeing you. I might run into you again sometime. I had fun with this little chat and this little reaction of yours. <laughs> All right. Take care. Ha, ha, ha.